Tangram Zoo. In this video, we will learn to make various animals through a tangram. Hello students! See what Bunny and Tuk Tuk are doing? Oh, they both are playing together. Meanwhile, Bunny asked Tuk Tuk another riddle. Imagine that you are in a school and the teacher is conducting a test in which you have to draw a camel. But you do not have a pencil or a pen and you cannot borrow it from your friends. The things you have are a few papers, scissors and glue. How will you draw a camel? Now Tuk Tuk is thinking. Can you help him in solving the riddle? Now let's see what Tuk Tuk answers Bunny. He says, I can make a camel with the help of paper, scissors and glue. Then Bunny says, how? Tuk Tuk says, by making a tangram. For this, I will fold the paper like this and cut this strip of paper. Now, I will get a square shaped paper. From this, I can make the tangram pieces. For this, I will fold the square shaped paper like this and cut it along the fold. Now, I will take a triangle and fold it like this and cut it along the fold so that I get two large triangles. After this, I will take another triangle and fold it like this and cut it along the fold. So I get one medium sized triangle. Now I will take the remaining part of the paper and fold it like this. Then I will cut it along the folds. So I get one small triangle and a square. After this, I will take the remaining part of the paper and fold it like this. Then I will cut it along the fold and I will get one small triangle and a rhomboid. In this way, I get all the shapes I need in a tangram. Now to make a camel, I will take two large triangles and paste them on another paper like this. Similarly, I will take a medium sized triangle and a square and paste them on the paper like this. And finally, I will take a rhomboid and two small triangles and place them on the paper like this. In this way, I can make a camel using all the tangram pieces. After hearing this, Bunny says, Very good Tuk Tuk, you are indeed very clever. So can you make a bird using these tangram pieces? Then Tuk Tuk says, Yes, absolutely. For our better understanding, now let's give numbers to these shapes. Now, to make a bird, I can arrange these shapes like this. Like this, and like this. And do you know that I can also make a stalk like this? After hearing this, Bunny says, That is very nice, Tuk Tuk. But can you also make a startled cat using a tangram? Then Tuk Tuk starts thinking. After a few seconds, Bunny says, Let me tell you how it's done. 
For this, first we will give numbers to these shapes like this. Now, to make a startle cat, we will arrange shapes 1, 2 and 5 like this. And we will arrange shapes 3 and 6 like this. And at last, we will arrange shapes 4 and 7 like this. In this way, we have made a startled cat. Tuk Tuk, do you know that we can make various animals using a tangram? Now you can try to make some more animals using a tangram. So students, I hope you understood how to make some animals using a tangram. Like Tuk Tuk, you can also try to make some more animals using a tangram. Thanks for watching this video. See you later.